Hey all, and welcome to Really Little Britain. Folks, tonight what have we got for you? We've got a bottle of beer all the way from Scotland, and it's part of, it's uh, the Harveston Brewery, and it's their Ola Dubba, okay? Their uh, 16 um, year old reserved, um, special reserved beer in Highland Park um, whiskey casks. Now, work in the island. Um, I've had, I think it's the 12 and 18 year uh, beers. And they're very very good um, so yes this is the 16 the special reserve I love the bottle I like the way they do these tags the black foil now let me tell you something they did one called old engine oil porter absolutely fantastic one of the best bottle porters in the UK now let's crack this open so this beer has opened with a lovely lovely light hiss and we're just going to take this foil off so we don't get, get it in the glass. Alright, we're going to go straight in with the pour. So this beer is pouring with light carbonation. This is an 8% beer, folks. So just a bit over the top for, really for a porter, it's um very much like a, a deep matured stout. So what we're getting there is a deep black colour, one finger head which is tightly packed, uh, just mock cream in colour, looking absolutely fantastic, folks. Look at that. Again, um, you don't really say this at the beginning of the review, but their head retention in that is lovely and slick as well. Let's go straight in with the nose. Okay, the first thing you pick up is that deep earthiness of the uh, old engine oil pour. You get quite a deep grassy hopness coming from it. There's oak, there's a light smokiness, there's some vanilla. There's a little bit of black treacle. Very good folks, we're going to go straight in. Cheers. Oh, oh my good god. That is so smooth. <clears throat> First thing you get is lovely dark roasted sweet malts. There's a little bit of oatmeal in there too, which is leaving this nice slickness to the beer. You're picking up um, oak, you're picking up vanilla, you're picking up a little bit of honey. You're picking up light sherry notes, some white wine, raisins. But what a beer which has matured very, very well. Uh, very, very well. I'm guessing this was bottled in probably 2014, possibly 2013. The expiry date on it is uh, 2017. The mouthfeel in the beer is wonderful. You don't get the 8% at all in the slightest. The whiskey aged barrel sits in the background but complements the malts. Um, this beer, on the flavour and the taste, um, you don't get the deep grassy um, hops you do get with the old engine oil porter, which is absolutely stunning. This is more of a mellowed out version. Um, even though it's stronger in ABV, you get that light warmness uh, of the alcohol from them Highland uh, whiskey casks. Um, very, very impressed and very, very smooth, folks. So what's the finish like? The finish is roasted malts, which are very smooth with a touch of oats, which leads to this wonderful light whiskey and a little bit bitter um, roasted finish, which has got a lovely um, tingle of alcohol warmness at the end. What do I give um, the Harvison Brewery for their Ola Dubba, their special 16 reserve um, malted whiskey cask beer? Folks, 330ml bottle. Look at the design. Look at the artwork, which is on India too. This to me, folks, it's a 9 out of 10 beer. It's a 9 out of 10 beer. It is very, very good. I'm going to get another one of these. I think I got this from the Grumpy Goat in Reading. Uh, and it was priced 5 35 I'm going to get another one, and I'm going to age it for another couple of years, just to see exactly what it's like. Fantastic beer from a fantastic brewery. That's really the Britain dinner review. 
on Harvest and Breweries, Oladubba, their, um, their special 16 reserve of a single malt whiskey from Highland Park. Cheers and Slamakara.